Hi Scorpio, welcome to my channel. My name is Kem. So today, Scorpio, for your meditative session, you guys got the humpback whale. Music is essential to your healing and well-being, whether singing, playing an instrument, or listening. There's just basically for you guys, they really want you to connect with music right now at this time. I feel like there's a lot of new albums out and I feel like they're trying to get you like into it. I don't know if you like you guys listen to mainstream music, but I feel like there's just a lot going on right now and I feel like music would be really helpful. If you like create music, then that's what they're trying to say. It's like if this is an outlet for you to like express yourself, then that's what's like if there's something that's bothering you or there's something you can't figure out, I feel like music would be really beneficial to you. Not just listening to it, but creating it. If you guys have never created music before, then I feel like this is kind of like that if you want to create music and you haven't yet, this is like that sign that you should be doing that because that's maybe it has something to do with your career to be to be really honest like i feel like music is very essential to like humanity and it some of us are like meant to work in music basically and i feel like this is a sign for a lot of you guys who have been like wanting to work in music that this is like your like your sign basically and again that there's a lot of like things out right now that could help with healing like listening to music uh and making it specifically even writing lyrics right so yeah, guys, that's what I'm getting for your meditative session, Scorpio. Let's pull some more cards and see what we get. So Scorpio, I see two true pairs here, right? I see the Seneschal and the King of Earth, and then I see the King and the Queen of Wands. And I feel like this is one couple. I feel like this one couple, I feel like they are, they create a lot of like final decisions, and then I feel like they, I what I feel like, I feel like it's like, you know, an end of a cycle, they realize a lot of things, right? This is, could be from the past, you know? They realize a lot of shit, they, they come to these conclusions that are very final and then I feel like they're kind of like wait I can't believe like I like I didn't really mean for that to be final but I'm not going to go back on their word my word and it kind of feels like a stubborn energy it kind of feels like a Taurus energy where it's like you know I don't want to go back but I made like a final decision already I can't go back but like in reality I feel like you can go back but there's like the stubbornness about how you ended something you've left or a like you've already left the situation so you you don't want to go back and that's what this kind of feels like it's like two people that I feel like they might even be with two other people do you know what I'm saying like but they but they still like think about each other and that's kind of what it feels like to be really honest What's so interesting in this reading is that I feel like there's two people with very, like there's unfinished business here with this union card and it's between these two people. So that's what I'm getting. It's like, there's these two people that like break up and they feel like they made it very final and they were like, you know what? Like this is, again, there's something here about how it's so final and now they're just like, wait, what the fuck like did I do? Do you know what I mean? Like I didn't, I don't necessarily mean for it to be like forever in this life. It was just, you know, maybe a year, maybe two years. Maybe like someone needed to get their shit together and now they're like, okay, I got my shit together and now it's like, where is this person at? You know what I mean? It kind of feels like that. It kind of feels like you can never really be final with this person. Even though you try to be, it's like you can't be. And I feel like with a lot of other people in your life, you've been very final. Like you've been very like judgmental and you've been like, okay, I'm not going back to the situation. But for some reason, there's someone here who is like going back. Like I feel like someone wants to go back and I feel like that's the problem here it's like someone wants to really go back to someone who they already left a long time ago or somebody wants to go back to like how things used to be with a person and I feel like they already kind of said like you know this wasn't working out I'm gonna leave and now it's kind of like uh 
where's this person at you know what i mean like i never really meant for it to be forever and they're seeing how like these this finality that they create can kind of be a problem for them because i feel like they're still missing they're missing someone basically right and yeah i just see like i just see like where they want they want to kind of come back to somebody and i feel like there's no like stability there there's no like opportunity to go there because someone's already kind of ended something with someone else and i feel like there's a lot of like honestly don't know if it's like I, I feel like this is the same people right this two kings and this two queens i feel like they're the same people going through life and they're just kind of like trying really hard to like create you see with this wand energy it's like they're trying so hard to create the relationship they had with each other right like this earth energy with each other like this th they're trying so hard to recreate this but they can't recreate it for some reason and i feel like that's where this comes in it's like it's the same people but just with like different people right and they're both trying to like get through it but they're getting through it in their own way and it's through their own stubbornness and i feel like they both kind of messed up to be really honest about i feel like two people like i don't i don't know if it's necessarily just one person who messed up here because i feel like here this king he has his problems as well, right? With this four of coins. And then I feel like the seneschal coming up in reverse. I feel like the seneschal could have been maybe a third party involved. Someone juggling with another person. So I feel like the queen had something like, you know, that she wasn't doing that was like healthy. And I see, I see for the king that there was something that he was doing that wasn't healthy, right? With this four of coins, this talks about someone who is very like, you know, the vulture is a greedy animal, right? The vulture will like <laughs> pick at the bones of something. And I feel like maybe that's what happened here it's like someone couldn't forgive someone else right someone couldn't put an end to the cycle and the opportunity kind of got missed but the, the interesting thing is i feel like there's just unfinished business here right there's like unfinished business with this union with these two people again i feel like it's two people that kind of messed up like maybe it was one person before another the queen is coming up first so maybe it was the queen who like initially did something messed up and then the king was like you know what this is this person's being shady i have to withdraw my energy and then they're both like okay well if you're gonna withdraw your energy then i'm gonna leave and then the person's like okay then if you're gonna leave then i'm gonna take away my energy as well and it's like two people are kind of just being very stubborn with one another and i feel like they really do care about each other and right now i just feel like this is all a facade right this want energy i don't feel like these are want people it's funny because we're going we're in scorpio and i just feel like these two want people that's not like who this person is you know what i mean that's not who this person is that's not who this person is but it's like they have to survive in this 3d and the way that they survive in this 3d is by being in this want energy right i feel like they're just down for like anything they're like having a good time they're gonna like sleep with other people basically they should try to forget about these people like this couple that they once were right and i feel like it's like again someone's withdrawing their energy it's they're withdrawing communication from this masculine and i feel like this masculine is being like kind of a player really to like other people and opening himself up to like a, a lot of different types of relationships because again there's just two people that i feel like are trying to really just forget about one another right but i just feel like there's such an unfinished business here with this union and this uh wheel of fortune and risk and i feel like the real blessing is this temperance card because i feel like there's they're they're trying to let you guys know that there's unfinished business here between the two of you and the reason that you guys yeah like maybe the queen fucked up maybe the king up maybe there's been a lot of like mistakes that have been made right in this relationship but i feel like at the end of the day that there's still love here between the two of you right and it doesn't matter how much you try to like move on to something new right like it's like you two are now here in this energy and i feel like it's like more of like i don't care energy you know what i mean i'm not i'm not stable as i once was but you know what like i'm i'm getting through it right and in some sort of fashion like i'm at least getting through my day and i'm at least like surviving right and i feel like that's a big deal for this people because i feel like without each other it felt really like shitty so they're just like learning how to be without each other is just really hard and it would just be so much easier if they would get back together <laughs> but i feel like they're not because i just feel like they're there's a lot of pain here there's a lot of like that's what i'm saying there's finality there's a lot of finals like oh i i'm not going back to this person i promised myself i wouldn't i told everybody that i wouldn't go back to this person and i feel like that's kind of what they want you to know it's like it's like reevaluate what you said i don't think there has to be a finality when it comes to love i think when it comes to love things should be like open right it's like i hate people who are like you know if something's unhealthy it's unhealthy and you're not meant to go back to it but for here i just feel like there's definitely some sort of unfinished business between these two people i feel like there's still like love between these two people and i feel like that's why the wheel won't turn right now they're rebalancing out the situation between the two and i feel like whatever these two people do to forget about one another it isn't as healthy like yeah they're coming up upright so i feel like it's not a bad energy 
but I, at the same time, I feel like this is not really them. It's like they're putting on these masks, right, to like cover up like how hurt they feel without being with the other person. And I feel like there's definitely like a real, real like strong connection here because we have you know the humpback whale and there's something to do with music so maybe music resonates with both of you guys maybe like music is a part of like your guys's like connection but yeah i feel like music maybe you guys send you just send each other songs or maybe each other like you made each other playlists and like that was something that you guys used to do for one another it kind of just feels like there's like a real connection with music here for the two of you but i feel like there's definitely like a reconnection that needs to be like looked at and i think that this finality of like oh we're not going to see each other again and that's it i think it's all bs to be really honest i think you guys still like love each other you still care about each other you guys try to put an end to this relationship and i feel like it's still in the back of your guys's mind so i feel like I feel like reconnection would really be the best thing and like kind of getting out of your own ways with this energy uh, You guys are trying to like act tough and like act really strong and like oh, I'm with someone else I moved on and oh, I'm with someone else and I moved on but at the end of the day Like it's like these two people really still want to be with each other and it's kind of confusing like why they're not <laughs> Why they're like putting on like an act basically at this point. That's what it feels like Let's see if there's any divine feminines for y'all So yeah, Scorpio, you guys got Zhao, you guys got Zhao Zhang Jing, the mystic of peace. I'm peace when my mind is clear, the way is clear. That's what I'm trying to say. It's like you guys need to come to some sort of peace between one another. Like you guys literally still think about one another. I think you guys still love each other. There has to be some sort of peace offering between the two of you. Like again, there's like. I, I said this and I did this mistake and uh, they'll never take me back and I made this mistake and they made this mistake and you know they messed up so many times how could I take them back there's just so much like between each other that I feel like you just need to forgive it and like again come to peace with this come to peace with the terms that like you really like love this person it doesn't matter what they do and come to the like fact like come to peace with the fact that you love this person do you know what I'm saying and like there's nothing <laughs> That's what it, it just feels like true love to be honest. So you know what I mean? Like people make mistakes sometimes, but at the end of the day, it's like there's just true love here. And I feel like there needs to be some sort of peace offering between the two of you. And I think the universe is really trying to like connect the two of you. And I feel like this is like the balancing out of this relationship. And I feel like they're doing it a lot through music. So music could be really important to you guys at this time. But yeah, peace has to be made between the two of you because this is like ridiculous. <laughs> this fake shit that you guys put on to like, even at like being with different people, when in reality, it's like these two people love each other. So yeah, Scorpio. It's kind of weird reading, but that's what I'm getting. I love you guys so much. I hope this resonates, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.